hello friends welcome back to my channel for today's video we are doing some diy wooden home decor to purchase any of the projects seen in today's video as well as the paint and products visit prestoneverydesign.com never thought it would be so hard i grew up without a scar just living my life with no big worries <laughs> To get started, I'm taking some bed posts that my friend Fabian brought me for free and I'm cutting them down using my drop saw so that I can get the parts that I need for my candle stands. Once I'm done, I'm going to go ahead and cut this plywood using my jigsaw. As you can see, I have already traced out a circle and I'm just going to follow it. Now this is going to be part of our risers. Once I have my circles curled out, they are not going to be perfect, but that is what 40 grit sandpaper is for. After that, I will just get my orbital sander and I'll get some 40 grit sanding paper and I will go ahead and even out those imperfections and we will have some beautiful circles. Oh, what came along, finding myself a much less happy. Back in the days I used to dream about one day A life so amazing Not everyone judging me once my circles are finished, we are going to go ahead and find the center of the circle and then we will drill a hole first using a drill bit to counter sink and then we'll go ahead and screw this into the candle stands. I am going to go ahead and still put some wood glue on them but I just want to make sure that I get my hole in the candle stand as well as the wood round to line up. Next we are going to move on to our wooden bowls that are going to be attached to these wooden candle stands. Now originally I had painted these separately in white but separately they did not really sell and so now we are going to put them together for a completely new product. Again I am countersinking before I attached my screw along with some wood glue. Once those are done, we are moving on to our candle stands. Now I'm using these wood rounds that I cut myself using my jigsaw. I'm going to go ahead and attach some wood glue. Now, because this is fence board, it's much easier to work with. I don't need a screw. I'm going to get my brad nailer and I'm going to use two inch nails to nail these together. And now that we are done assembling, here's what we have. We have these risers. Forget that screw in the middle. You won't see it once I put the finishing touches to this project. We then have our candle stands with the fence board and we have our wooden ball risers. Everything is done. Now it's time to paint and do the fun part. The color choice for today's video is a combination of 50-50 mint chip and gypsy green. I mix this myself. If you do want this color combination, both gypsy green and mint chip DIY paint colors are available on my website and I have linked them in the description of this video. Again, I have nothing more to put on. I'm defeated and withdrawn. Trying to understand where it went wrong. Always believe that nothing good in life is free, but it's overwhelming how people can hate on me. Don't wanna care about them, though it hurts so Shut down. 
care about them Though it hurts so bad I wanna stay wide open I'm going to get my DIY white wax along with a chip brush and I will white wax the best of these. I'm not going to wax the top yet because we are going to be doing something special to them. Don't wanna care about them Though it hurts so bad I wanna stay wide open All right, now that we're done waxing, here is the fun part. I am taking this IOD Sunflower Transfer and I'm going to use the little applicator stick that comes with your transfer and I'm going to put these on top of the risers. And now that the stands are finished, all that's left to do with these balls and the candle stands is to white wax them and then we will be finished. So that concludes today's video, you guys. Thank you so much for tuning in. Be sure to let me know which was your favorite project. I think I like the stands with the sunflowers. Until next time, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye. Everything